Welcome to Learnpedia. Score more and rank better in JE and NEET. Now take a look at this actual NEET question and see if you can answer it. If you think you got the answer, then post it in the comment section below. To know the best way to answer this question, continue watching this video. General structure of viruses. Size. Virus particles are called virions. Size of a virus ranges from 10 to 300 nanometers. The smallest virus is bacteriophage F2. The largest virus is vaccinia virus. These vaccinia viruses are so large that they can be seen under compound light microscope. Let us see the shapes of the viruses. See these are rod like, they are rod shaped. Example tobacco mosaic virus. Rectangle shape, example vaccinia virus. This is polyhedral, example adenovirus. These are the spherical viruses, spheroidal. This is a common cold virus. This is a polio virus. This is a HIV virus. These are the models of the viruses. Here is the bacteriophage, which is tadpole shape, means it has a head, a tail, and at the end of the tail, it has a tail plate, which is hexagonal, and to the tail plate are attached what are called tail fibers. This virus has bullet shape, example, rhabdovirus. Whatever be the shape and the size of a virus, the virus consists of an outer protein coat, enclosing the nucleic acid, which is the genetic material. So the viruses are referred as nucleoproteins. The protein sheath is called capsid. The structural units of the capsid are called capsomeres. The enclosed nucleic acid may be either DNA or RNA, but never both are present. Most of the animal viruses possess an outer envelope enclosing the nucleocapsid. It is made up of lipids, proteins and carbohydrates. It is called peplos and its subunits are called peplomeres. The virion that is the virus particle has no protoplasm or cytoplasm. So it cannot metabolize on its own because it has no protein synthesizing mechanism. That is why when it is outside a host, it is an inert chemical. When it enters into its specific host, the DNA or RNA utilizes the protoplasm of the host by taking command over and synthesizes its own proteins. Look at this image. This is the image of HIV virus. This is the protein coat, otherwise called capsid. The units of protein, they are called capsomeres. Of course, this is the genetic material. And in case of HIV, the genetic material is RNA. The viruses which have RNA as genetic material are called retroviruses. Now this symmetry, symmetry of viruses, helical symmetry. This is the image of tobacco mosaic virus. Look at the genetic material. It is spirally coiled and also the capsomeres also are spirally arranged. So this symmetry is called helical symmetry. Cubic symmetry. This is the cubic symmetry. Viroids. Viroid. Anywhere in biology, if you get the syllable oid, 
it is like for example zooid means animal like viroid means virus like there are viruses which have either nucleic acid or proteins so viruses having only nucleic acid without a protein coat are called viroids prions the viruses have only proteins without a nucleic acid are called prions the viroids and prions cause their specific diseases in plants and animals diseases caused by viroids potato spindle tuber and citrus exocortosis disease diseases by prions scrappy disease of sheep mad cow disease of cattle hey there hope you understood the concept here's the answer to the question that was asked in the beginning keep watching to give an edge to a je and need preparation Learn BDS JE and Need Prep tools contain over 4000 videos and over 20000 questions. You can access them online through our website or offline through an SD card or a pen drive. To buy now, visit www.learnpedia.in. You can also try a free demo of the product before buying.